In 2011, during Tunisia's revolution in my country, uh, the world was really focused on looking at what's going on in the Middle East, but I was really fascinated about youth activism uh, and youth movements who were inspired by our movement across the African continent. We have powerful stories, but it's always uh, set, uh, written and told by others. Um, and I think that's when I really wanted to create a platform where we can document our own stories from an African and youth-led perspective. I call it Afresist, but that does not uh, imply only civil resistance, that does not imply only uh, regime change, it implies the daily resistance, uh, the everyday citizen, the everyday activist. One of the major goals of Afresist is to do research with the aim of documenting nonviolent resistant movements across the African uh, continent, which are led by young people. In August of 2018, we met with 16 participants to come up with the toolkit and design and decide upon what the themes are going to be. So we decided on three themes, the Pan-African theme, leadership theme from an African perspective and non-violence from an African perspective. I'm interested in how we can add value and I, and I see this as a process not just to come and be taught to train others, but this is for me is a co-creation platform. We're creating the content as we go along, and it's an opportunity to shape a content that will be used to train and raise the next generation of African youth leaders. Africist is an African story that uh, its time has come, and I believe African people are ready, and it's a training program that will ensure that the values of what makes us who we are is out there and my one-year-old daughter will be part of it uh, by the time she grows up. I mean, she's been breastfed by a Pan-Africanist mother, why not? Afrizist is a think It's very important to travel the continent and part of that is understanding how our realities are similar, how our histories are shared, and how our future really is tied together. So I think the training will help um, emerging young African leaders see from the jump why they should actually be working together and working in the interest of the continent. I believe a lot in Frisis, that's why I'm here, because I think it's a concept that qui va réunir beaucoup de jeunes. Et je pense que par l'approche la, déjà, il y a une approche qui est assez différente de beaucoup d'autres mouvements qui existent aujourd'hui en Afrique pour pouvoir changer le leadership africain en quelque chose de plus mieux. Euh, if we can all rally behind Afrizis, it's a program that can really, really um, inspire change because we need to start thinking about um, how to, to, to liberate Africa ourselves. We do not need an external savior. We do not need some other person to come and tell us how to change a continent that we are the ones living in it, that we understand we are the only saviors that we have. So Afrizis is a concept that comes with that kind of idea to transform us, to empower us, to document what we are already doing that we can replicate in other continents and at the end of the day if we all do everything in all African countries we have a movement. Afrizis pour moi c'est une opportunité donnée à la jeunesse africaine de faire face aux problèmes auxquels elle est confrontée d'une manière innovante et d'une manière concrète. The really end goal and the vision for Afrizist on a longer term is to set a new model of leadership that is based on the values of Ubuntu and togetherness, uh, to start a conversation about new Pan-Africanism because we have read history from the perspective of the 50s and 60s and these Pan-Africanists might not have actually set a model of Pan-Africanism because they reacted to colonialism. So we hope that Afrizist will start that journey of uh, establishing new models of leadership and uh, a new concept of new Pan-Africanism. So join us in being an Afrizist uh, trainer, 
or convener or uh, a researcher to document uh, these stories, this impact, and to empower with us uh, this generation and the next generation of Pan-Africanists. Join Afrizist and reclaim our power as Pan-Africanists. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, yeah. Swahili first, then I'll say it in Kata Tama, hey, Maisha Yaki.